In this video we're going to download the Scorpion editor, uh, give it a quick run and then start work on another level for the Alex Kid demo. So just going to download the zip file to start with. Then all we need to do is open the editor folder and run scorpioneditor.exe ok we're going to select Alex Kid from the demo projects folder ok so we're going to test the project under emulated Amiga 500 settings so all we need to do is click the run in FSUAE button Okay, now that we know it's all working, we're going to um, we're going to go to smspower.org, um, where they've got map rips of the entire game. We'll just uh, open this image, and I'll just paste it into PaintShop Pro. So I need to make a couple of real quick tweaks first. Um, so as you can see, the the tiles don't perfectly align with the 16 by 16 grid. So we'll move everything just to the left a little bit. Oops. And we just need to cut off that um, last section. All right. So now that we've got an image we can use to import into the engine, so I'll just save that as level 2. Now if we go here and we go import level from PNG, we just need to save that, so we'll save it as level 2. Okay, so what we've got is we've got the level and we've got a tile set. Um, but before we can really do anything with the level, we uh, need to make some changes. So um, I'll edit these tiles. So let's find all of the solid blocks. and we'll flag those as solid so we can actually walk on them okay that's all we need, need to do in the tile set for now so we'll go to the level itself and we'll edit that so when we import a level from a PNG it uh, attaches three tile sets. So one is the tile set for the actual level, the others are generated ones for our actors and for our blocks. Um, I'll go into actors in more detail in another video. For now I'll select um, our Alex Kid um, object and make sure that we're adding him to the objects layer so we can just put him anywhere, I'll just put him, put him over there. Okay, so now that we've got the the level in the project, we need to load it from script. So I'm just going to make a quick change here. Um, this is the line where we load level 1. Instead, we will load level 2. 
I'll run that in FSUAE. Hopefully this will all work first time. Okay, I have a slight bug with the scrolling. So what I need to do, I'm going to take out this line here. What that line did previously was it meant it fixed the camera so that for the cliff level you, the camera only moved downwards. So I'll take that out so that the camera can move in any direction and we'll try that again. Okay, that's better, but there's not really much we can really do at the moment. Um, we will need to go through and replace all of these tiles. Uh, but for now, one thing we will do quickly is we'll make it so that the block that I'm standing in will uh, kill the player character. So we need to add a new block to our tile set. What we'll do is I'll just grab that tile right there I'll save that as a new image so we'll put that into the Alex Kid blocks and we'll call this acid block So we need to create um, data for that block. So we'll go to Assets and New Block. Just save that as Asset Block. Uh, we need to assign the the block image. And now we need to set some uh, properties. So uh, the only one re we really need to set is for when the player collides with it. Uh, we need to use player kill, which uh, is an existing script um, right here. Uh, all that does is that stops the music, plays the death sound, um, changes the player into a ghost and then waits for 100 frames or 2 seconds before restarting the level. So now that we've got that block in our project um, we can go back to edit our level again. Now if we go into blocks you'll see that we have a new acid block. Uh, so that was added to our tile set automatically when we open the editor. Now we do need to add this to the objects layer. Um, for for interactive blocks, they have to be on the objects layer. The map layer is just for the static background. So we'll just add one tile there for now. I'll just save that. Then I'll emulate that again.
and there we go.